Hello everyone, Dave again. Welcome back to more Snow Runners. We left off uh, on this slow, ag ag like agonizing journey. I can't even say the words properly. I'm so agonizingly slow journey to bring a full bridge payload out here at once in this beginnerish truck, and it is slow going to best. I just had to recall the truck and drive it all the way back out here to get. Mostly full tank of gas, almost. I mean, it took this much to get back out here and re-pick up the concrete part because you lose your cargo when you fast recall back. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's been painful to say the least here. Um, I've been trying to get the quick winch down here so we can use it as I just drive kind of seamlessly here. Helps a little going up these things. Pulls just a little extra. It's not great at all. And the rain sure as heck ain't helping in my situation here with speed being my objective. This is just. Oof. Oof, that is really all I can say here. If I pick up any small tree like this one with the winch, it just immediately rips it out and tears it down. So I might trust a little bit much for these little baby trees to hold up. That one did well. It's all because I said something. Up until this point, any time I've tried to grab onto any of these small trees, they just snap off and don't really help me in any way, shape, or form. That's not a terrible winch point. Yeah, like that one, you just, you just rip straight down. This one will probably do the same. Helps it a little. But not very much. Oh boy, getting up this hill with no no help is gonna be a thing. Let's drop her in the low and do the diff. Just all oh, the fuel. Get on up. Got like eighty thousand tons of shit on the back. But let's go. Just fuck to the floor. Truck's trying so hard. She'll get it. I trust her. Just the winch here. Uh, we're almost up there. We're almost back on pavement. If I remember correctly, it's just like a quick all. Oh, there's a little river. Oh boy. Little river of doom. No good trees either. Taking out of low didn't really change much of anything. I'd say I'm worried about the river washing me away, but I don't think that river has anywhere near enough infinite to do something like that. Ooh, good winch point. It's a bigger tree too. It snapped it. It's a big enough tree where it helped. Oh baby, pull. Oh. Trying to get it to one of those telephone poles. Apparently, I can't though. Going to auto. A little drive on this road. I think we made it. An hour later. Dang it, we made it. No tasks, Mountain Bridge, except. No tracking, cargo management, spacebar. Unload. And unload again. We made a bridge, just like that. I say just like that, but that was a long just like that. Okay. What does that get me? That means I can avoid that road. I don't know if this road's much better for getting to the warehouse. Either way, that's what that got me. That was super painful. Now we're just gonna turn off the handbrake, turn off all the drive. We're just gonna cruise down the new road we made. That's the bridge out here. Enjoy the light load driving of my international here. Ooh, this thing fully loaded up was just so crazily slow. Um, okay, we're getting out of control here. A little bit fast for this truck, it would seem. Oh, road kind of ends there. 
Back to our nice, slow, normal pace we got here, just chugging along. Kind of reminds me of a gas station right here. Maybe there was a much better alternative route to go. Is that a fuel tank? That looks like a fuel tank. Trailer, a huge fuel tank trailer. That looks like right there. That would be considered one of those heavy trailers, right? Or is that not technically a trailer that I can take? Lame. See fuel, 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 fuel. Close. There's their stuck vehicle. New objective. Missing oil tank discovered. Um... Missing oil tank. This thing. Missing machinery. Stuck trailer. Um... No, this is where this is missing oil tank. Here it is. Um, ooh, that's way up there. I mean, technically, I made an offer of truck. You were being technically. I think I'm just gonna keep on going down this road, then probably bring the trailer to the garage. And look at what that wood bridge over there needs. Maybe go do that quest. Try and do some more bridge quests. Finish some infrastructure. Oh, it's okay, truck. I know, it's hard. Really hard to just go forward sometimes. Oh, I think we're gonna ditch the trailers all together with this baby. It's just too much for it. It drove acceptable without trailers but with the trailers i mean it's just a total slog fest i think we explored a lot of stuff that we didn't have explored previously not really know what the best way to go to get to the warehouses i mean theoretically it's through the back of this farm right here so they might frown upon slightly just going through their trees and through their fence and onto their property. Oh my dust farmers, just you know your local truckers coming through. Doing we do best, destroying property. Killing cornfields, wrecking shit. No one seems to mind though. Everyone just kinda lets me do what I want. For some weird ass reason, that's for sure. Yep. It's coming through your cornfield. Sorry about this. It happens though. Not exactly to blame. I wonder what I can pick up here. Didn't check. Didn't checked. Looks like just a farm. So I don't imagine anything super useful. Bragging ass here. Oh, this is just shit. There's more mud here, that's right. This thing doesn't handle mud very well. The other trucks, this isn't really mud, it's just water for some reason that's here. Anti truck. You're so helpless. Like, explain to me why this thing is going this slow. Is that trailer just 17,000 pounds by itself? like 100,000 pounds by itself for a truck of this magnitude to go in this slow. My force up shifts here? Oh, come on now, truck. Seems I can force up shifts? Interesting. That was weird. I'm gonna have to do some more testing with this truck and see if there's just better ways to drive it. Little gimmicks. All I was doing was double tapping the gas and she was taken off. Um, 
make this turn. I'll park this trailer somewhere else. Litter trailers all over the place here. The detached trailer. Take me into the garage, please. Totally 100% done with this thing. Move to garage. Truck store. How much was it to buy that thing? Off road. It was 83, 100. And to sell it is what? 83. Salt 88. 88 plus that. 88. 90. 100. Like 120,000, right? Um, I don't know why this thing has such good stats for how shit it was doing. I mean, like, it's doing so shit. Um, yes, let me go back here, truck storage, and Kevlar switchable, switchable. Loy customized tires. train tires see if it makes a difference don't know if it actually will anyway shape or form not supposed to suck which sucks and I don't know what to do about it just don't Fuel carriage. Told myself we were done with this shit. Wooden bridge. 
Wooden bridge needs two wooden planks. Um, inconvenient at best. It makes me want to go across there. I think this truck can do it though, so it's not that big of an issue. Let's just go do that then. Test out these new wheels and the mud up here. See if she's any better at it, because she's a shit truck if she's not. Probably sell her off and try and pick up some of those uh, heavy trucks and try them out. Because something's wrong with her. She just doesn't drive the way she should. In any way, shape, or form. Don't bounce off that. Don't break your suspension and shit. You're fine, truck. Seems to be doing a lot better until this. But this isn't really her fault. This would be my fault for going too crazy. But she got herself out of it, so. Just need to change the tires, I guess? Those highway tires suck in this game. So it seems, but I really need to be careful driving her like that because. Got some speed and that. We have one wrong thing at that speed, and you're done for the truck exploding a bunch of bits everywhere. Handling okay, though. I'm okay with this pace. Tires really made that big of a difference. It's crazy. It's nuts, actually. Um, that's my wife for you. She just came in here to bother me, and she just threw her back out the other day first day she's finally feeling able to walk around the first thing she wants to do is go move more trees around branches and stuff out in the backyard uh, she can do what she wants to strong independent woman but dang it she can hurt her back again hope she doesn't hope it works out but what can you do I know what you can do you can play some snow runners and just keep on keeping on um, is it this right I want? No, I want the left across the bridge. Um, so I'm going to... Where am I going? I'm supposed to be doing lumber mills what I'm doing. I'm going to the lumber mill. I wonder if the warehouse will give me everything I could need and going all the way over here is totally pointless, but I don't actually 100% know. I guess I could turn on my headlights, no reason not to. Keep on, keep it on. So I'm just relaxing about these games, and I don't know why. You're just kind of like chugging around in your trucks, doing what you want to do. Oof, bouncing off the railings. Having fun doing it, but bouncing off rounds nonetheless. This bridge should be fairly easy to make. It's only two wood things. I'm going to try this in this truck. See if she can do it. With ease she can do it. I don't know why the hell that road's closed off. That road does not need to be closed off. Drive by refueling here, C, F, 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 continue. Never even come to a full stop because we're pro like that. And that was the least pro ever. Whoa, 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 whoa. As you can tell by my epic driving skills, they're totally least pro. Um, especially when you just don't go the way you're supposed to be going. So we're going to be doing a little bit of uh, back road terrain in here. Hmm. This isn't quite where this back road starts, but alas. I don't really know how to untrack and track some of these quests, because for whatever reason I seem to be stuck on tracking this one quest that I don't really feel like doing at this current moment in time. I have so far out of my way to go. No! Full rollover? Totally okay with that. It's fine. Just need to be more cautious. Apparently this baby's top heavy. She's not quite built for this kind of off-roading here, it seems. Ugh. I mean, I am going some nonsense way because I didn't put waypoints down. I know better than not put waypoints down. Okay. 
Turn off the all wheel drive because we should be good now. Ugh, oh, this truck is so much better with his tires. It's insane. Let's see how she does with a load on her. Um, when it was just the concrete load, she did halfway okay without these tires. The tires just make such a ludicrous difference, it seems. Um, sawmill. Okay. Cargo management, wood planks, wood planks. Now I'm doing it here. Here. Please. Thank you. This is where we're headed, right? Um, yeah. Now, um, no. This one can go. That one can go there. This one can go here. This one can go. Okay, what have I done? We done fucked up everything. This one can go there. We can go there. And we're going. Here. Here. This road's gonna be a mistake. I can guarantee you that much. It's washed out road. Not a clue in the world if we can even get by it, but dang it, we're gonna try. And around here and to the wood bridge. So what is the absolute worst that could possibly happen? We get stuck in, dug in, mudded in, snowed in. And snowed in be interesting, especially because there's no snow on this map. But let's go for it. To town we go. Into a truck, it's just some wood. A lot of wood. But. Show me, you got it. A pill all wheel drive just to keep a little bit more oomph on you. Man, this truck is capable now. The YouTubers need to say you need to change the damn tires if you want to start without a truck, because this truck's a beast. Choo choo. Coming up the hill. It's gonna turn off all wheel drive. She seems to be doing just fine without it. Yeah, fifth gear here. Just jam it. Keep on keeping on. Um, I think I'm supposed to take this left because I skipped a waypoint, it would seem. Yep, that was the correct left. Holding fifth gear. I don't know why this lane is closed. We're gonna reopen that lane. I'm kind of the one in charge of what's closed and what's not closed. And I say that should be open. So we're good here. I'd rather not attach trailer and I'd rather you stop taking up a massive amount of my screen with the pop-ups. Thank you very much. Big test here is gonna be this mud. Because this truck has been defeated the bore and cargo with mud. Um, or with cargo and mud before. It's going to be a massive test right here. So this is with no all-wheel drive. Just basically full stop. And all-wheel drive, she just kind of keeps driving. That's crazy. Um, see if she gets completely 100% bogged down in this deep water with these tires. Ah, oh, she just keeps on chugging. This is everything she's got, though. It's low with diff. And we'll make it there, slowly but surely. Start doing some of this automatic winching shit. Just to help me out a little bit. Wheels turn that way a little bit to counteract the winch pull. Oops, did not mean to turn off while wheel drive. Back to all. It seems to be working out better for me here. Oof. Oh. Okay. Too deep. Too deep, and I'm kind of one wheel off the road into some deeper water. But I knew this road was going to be beyond treacherous. So this is some shit you should not be driving a truck through. There's something you just never drive anything through unless it's like a freaking swamp boat or a hovercraft. Here we are. Pushing on. Let's go, winch. Hold me to safety. Only but surely. 
There's just some logs in front of me. Well, I don't want to run into those with how slow we're moving. I might tap one of them. No, we're good. Rear wheels might tap one, but it ain't no biggie. see why they want this bridge fixed like people don't have to drive through this shit on the daily track man that would be ridiculous like, where do these people work how do they even get to work it's just totally not feasible in any way shape or form oh, i want to connect to that tree over there all right no available winch points Oof. If I go a little bit off the beaten path, it can't hurt too much, right? Like, it's hard to go slower than this. I think. Up over the tree. I'm getting kind of deepish here. Maybe I shouldn't go that far off the beaten path. Oh, don't be too swampy. It doesn't matter where I go or what I do down here. We just move at the same pace. Can you imagine being up in that house? You're like, what the fuck is that motherfucker doing down there? You jazz low, just mudding it. Mud trucking. I'm going. I like the progression they put in this game with like the levels and all that stuff. It's actually pretty solid. Not gonna lie here. Need your meta member to edit this at 17 minutes, everyone. I want to forget. Oh, we're pushing. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do, but whatever. I may I put a winch there. I meant to just do the quick winch system. Just keep forward progression. I really need some good radio for this game. I just made this so much better. I don't even know what kind of radio. There's all the different radio stations. Like, I understand the licensing fees and all that stuff. And you run the copyrights with YouTube and streamers. Like, I get that there isn't, but dang it. It would be so much better with some just rock and roll music or something to keep you entertained as you're just slugging through this crap. Straightforward winches are always nice. Gotta be coming up on that bridge soon, right? Coming up on the sketchiest part of this whole journey. Uh, that's for sure. Tunnel. Construction site. Auto and all wheel drive. Okay, see the road under here. Kinda, sorta. Me down, truck. Let's kick her back into low here. Put on the diff. Just chug through that water. Beautifully done, truck. Beautifully done. All in all, I'm too shabby if I do things on my sound. A nice wooden bridge to be built here. This is where the construction site is. Don't know if that would be really doable with a load in a trailer in this truck though. That water area is very, very, very bad. And this is pretty bad also right here. Some very thick mud. Mud up here too. Urgh. 
Double rev it and get out of that garbage mud down there. Oh, it's tree stump. Well, thank you, tree stump. It's gonna say, please let me do this from this side. Oh, if I rolled over right there, I'd be so, so pissed. Please let there be a drop off on this side of the bridge. I'm be so ripped. And by so ripped, I mean I'd go park a truck on the other side and try and get across it either way. Err. Cargo management, offload. Wooden bridge, just like that. That's ghetto. If I've ever seen ghetto. Pretty darn good to settle up and get those trucks across. Thanks again. You're welcome, my buddy. Um, International Peace Star. What do I still have? We got roadblock blocking this main road, and we have fallen power line. What does the fallen power line mean? I don't think I've actually ridden out to the fallen power line. Metal planks, concrete blocks. Well, I mean. Concrete blocks aren't the hardest thing to get anymore. Because. Does... Just take that road. You go up over and down over, and you get concrete blocks here. But it looks like you have to come from this side. So, like. Is you gotta go all the way around. Long little trek there. Not gonna lie on that one. By the way, that'll probably be the next thing I do is probably the fallen power lines. Really do appreciate y'all stopping by, checking out the video, do all the YouTube stuff like like, comment, subscribe, hit the thumbs up button. Um, also watch all the videos front to back, so it really helps YouTubers analytics. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Dig figured. Crane apple.